I mean, I mean, I mean, did you guys hear that? That is a banger. It's a, like, I don't know, I'm literally jamming to this song. I've been listening to it from yesterday. I actually listened to it for the first time yesterday and I've been jamming to it since then. And I'm sure you guys are going to jam to it. You're going to vibe to it as well. Now, welcome back. You are watching Bounce Nation in case you're just joining us right now. My name is Philin Jean and of course I'm hanging out with King Kingsley, a.k.a. Top Boy. No, 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 Top Boy in the Lake Shika. What are you talking about? I'm so glad take for granted. Of course, we love that. We appreciate the love that you guys show us. We don't take that for granted. Now, come on, how are today being a Tuesday? We have that. Well, uh, Remix Battle Tuesday. We have mm. two songs. We're going head to head to compete for the spotlight today. Kamakawa, this Team Philin versus Team King King. And you're winning. Uh, no, we are winning. <laughs> Tuesdays in a Kwangazetu. We are winning. Tuesdays in a Kwangazetu. All right, so who mapema. do we have? Who do we have? Just remind the guys at home. Nani uh, Tukoneleo. We had two songs. The first song is uh, Distance by J Rocks. I'm a fan of na AY. The second song is called Reverse Remix. We are tying. You guys are gonna have to do better. Team feeling manze. Unajua maku ku support. That's why nafungulia gasava mapema. Allah. Maku ku support. Like watu wangu wacha raka nithi watakuja. Siwai kwa hivyo. Wana kujanga last minute wana geuza serikali. The second song was reverse remix by the Luchi. Major DJ Leta de Mwere Mande na Manzele. And for those who don't know what he's talking about, akisema reverse. Team feeling munavotia tuende reverse. Uh, 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 remember it was such a banger it's still a banger it's a classic so if you love that song make sure you vote for us the only way to vote when the palette twitter team y254 vote your favorite alternatively kama hauna twitter kama kingsley hapa hivi tuko pale facebook tuko na post and comment below useme ni ngoma gani una feel ni reverse ama ni ingine inetua uh distance unawana munawana madarao Ako na madarao, mbaka ya hizi kumbuka yangu. Na zuwatu yangu na nimeshika. But anyway, thank you so much for staying with us. We appreciate each and every one of you. And of course, being on Bounce Nation, you know we gotta give spotlight to the people who deserve it. Kama ini msani na unajituma na tunapenda kazi yako. We gotta have you right here in studio. Come join us. And today, we're not even playing a lot. Okay, we have another 254 artist that's gonna be coming in later. But right now, we have an international artist all the way from, okay, from Nigeria. She's not only pretty but super talented. She's a performing and recording artist. She's a designer. She's a jack of all trades. She's blessed in so many ways. And of course, she made time. Yeah. Ali make of course. Of she course. created time yeah. just to be here today with us. And of course, give it up. Ladies and gentlemen, mm -hmm. are we ready? Let's yeah. give it up for Lisa George. Let's go. <laughs> uh, sharing squad, you're failing me. Let's go. Let's give it up. Yay! <laughs> Where? Now we are talking. Meskia, what's our home? We have a cheering squad. No, no, budget ya mendiwe. Budget ya mendiwe jiao watu. Kwa hito kwa budget. Cheering. You know that DJ Ali to fail. Like, ding, ding, ding. Sio mimi, sio mimi, sio mimi, ni mixer. So, jiwa kuna kengele, sasa, aondo kengele yetu. Yeah, bana. Like, ni msiwa misi. So, jiwa kuna watu, sema, kengele. All right, thank you. Welcome to the show. Thank you. So good to have you. Thank you, thank you. And of course, you look so pretty, though. Like, in person, like, even better in person than Portuguese. Are you serious? Yeah, of course. Thank you. I hear that a lot. Thank you very much. All right, good to have you. So, you're going to do me a favor? Okay. Yes, now we are talking. Okay. Welcome to Bouncing Nation and welcome to Kenya. Is this your first time here? This is my first time in Kenya. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, tell us about your experience. How are you finding it? Fine. I think today is the first day I actually went out. Like, I came out. I came in two days ago. Oh, yeah. So I have to just rest and this catch my breath. Uh -huh. Did you guys so. hear that? <laughs> it is the first time she's, like, she came to Kenya to, like, leave the house. And we are getting an exclusive. Yeah. They may find her. You may finish that. You may finish that. You may finish that. With a minute. In a minute. Yeah. All right. How are you finding Kenya too far? far so far? It's 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 a new place for me. You know, I'm just trying to adapt to mm -hmm. the whole African vibe thing. Yeah, because it's quite different from where I'm coming from. But right, I, I know. I know. had a friend of mine from West Africa come in, and he's okay. been here for a while. Okay. And the food was really hard for him. Are you, are you having the same problem? No, 
I have to go. I have to look for Nigerian food. <laughs> I just have to. <laughs> I just I have know. to. Like, but I'll try. I'll try. I'll try some Kenyan food before I leave. Sure. You should. So we have ugali. It's more like fufu. Ugali. Only okay. like ours is a little bit. Um, okay. High. Yours is softer. Yeah. Because, oh. You know, ours is maize. Oh, yours is uh, corn. Yeah, oh. yeah, ours is corn. Okay. And yours is uh, cassava. Cassava, so yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. And there's oh. something else that I, I, I think I'm a try. Mm -hmm. There's something called smocha. 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 Yes. I have to. He's I have laughing. to ask him. Yeah, he knows it. I have to ask it. him. I yeah, I'll try it on. Tell him to take you to somewhere that. Somewhere they, where they sell it. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. Yeah, and street food. We have amazing street food. Oh, you should oh, try it. Yeah, that, nice, that's nice. what actually it's, a, it's part of the street. I'm here food. to explore. Or my pasua. <laughs> pasua. <laughs> What's that? Smoky yeah. pasua. And they only come in two. Yeah. Okay. You can't, you can't have one. Whoa. Yeah. When you go there, tell them to nigonge mbili. Gonga and Billy. Yes. Ah, you got it. You got Gonga it. Gonga and Billy. It. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Now, take us through your music journey. I know you started singing at a very early age. Yeah. At age seven. Yes. That's a long time. Right yeah, now. that's, so a, that's that. a long time. I started mm -hmm. singing when I was, you know, very tender. Mm -hmm. I started from school, church, and everything. Then it got to a point when I have to go for MTM Project Fame. Right. Yeah, in Nigeria. Yeah. It's, it's a competition. So after the Project Fame, I didn't win, but I was like, no, I think I need you to. You got to Experience. to get me i was like mm -hmm. no i need to i need to take this serious mm -hmm. that was 211 mm -hmm. then after then i took a break because I, I dropped some couple of songs then mm -hmm. then i took a break i got back i after the break i now came back uh 2018 and since the 2018 i've been giving it back to, to back, back to back to back a period i know and we love that <laughs> but then uh, let me take you just back a little bit yeah um, because growing up you used to listen to a lot of bob Marley and yeah my and mom my yeah so are they were they some of your influences when it comes uh, to yeah i music think music? i think so i think so because when i was much younger my mom used to listen to a whole lot of jamaican music mm -hmm. bob Marley, dinah king uh, dana rose rather yeah um Patra, pa, uh, 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 what's her name again? I've forgotten. That Cleopatra. was quite, Cleopatra. That yeah. was a long time ago. Mm -hmm. So, but all those things builds me, like it, 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 it developed the sound I have. Yeah. Do you understand? So, I think that's played a huge role in my career. Yeah. You know, you with my that, sound, rather. In, in your sound. With my and sound, who, yeah. Who you identify mm -hmm, as. Mm -hmm, as mm -hmm. who Lisa is right now. Yeah, Lisa. Lisa. <laughs> I don't know why I keep calling her. I always say Lisa, and then I'm like, Lisa. 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 Or Gaza. Lisa. Uh, uh, Gaza. And, yeah, yeah, Gaza. that's the AKA Gaza. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Gaza, you know, okay. But okay, another thing I saw that you're most interested in is uh, speaking for women. Yes. Yeah, you want to be the voice yes. of women. Like, yeah, why do you feel that in your music? Okay, I... First of all, mm -hmm. m what I stand for, I stand for equality, gender equality. Mm -hmm. You know, I there's a song I did when I went to Ghana. Some, I think, was it last year or thereabout? Yeah. So after I, I went to Ghana, I heard something called girls are, uh, abre. Abre means tired in Ghana in three language. I'm not from there, but yeah. I like learning new things whenever I, I travel. Oh, wait, just, sorry. So that's where the song came from. <laughs> that's abre. where the girls are, yeah. Because girls are have, tired. Yeah. Girls, mm. we're tired. We don't mm. belong to that room. Mm. We're tired. We want to become more. We want to do more in society. Mm. We need more rooms in society. Yeah. That was where the whole um vibe or rather but it's something that i i find very interesting in speaking using my voice to you know speak for women do you think women are where they're meant to be or no we still we're, we, we still we no we're not we're not even where we're meant to be because women are full of potentials like we, we are we're too much yeah we are, we are we are much like when i mean much we are we're full of you know we we can we have a space in the society and the society is not giving us that platform that room to become more but some especially guys, here in Africa. Yeah, especially in Africa. But some people feel like uh, we, we've been given a lot of uh, platform lately. Mm -hmm. Like everybody is just like every NGO and every yeah, you know, it's support getting, group it's is actually getting better, but yeah. not. And the thing we forgot we're not, the we're not there yet. We're not there yet. <laughs> we're not there. We're yet. not there. But, but it's a good start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we're, we're moving on. We're moving on. <laughs> All right, and uh, because of that, because you you feel you you support women a lot, mm -hmm. you also have a charity. Did you start it just because you wanted to support women? as well no 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 it's something i i decided between me and god mm -hmm. that i have to be doing for the less privileged mm -hmm. orphans um uh less opportune people in general mm -hmm. not just children yeah so i do that every end of the year so whenever i even travel anywhere i just look for people where people are, are not you know where you know the society you know how african is yeah. 
a whole lot is not just happening the way it should happen. So I just look for people that need the help more and just lend my help any which way I can. I do that every end of the year, especially in my country. But I've tra traveled to Ghana and I did a couple of it, some giveaway to some less opportune people in Ghana. So mm -hmm. probably I might do that here in Kenya. So it's something I... I just of course, for. we're like we're gonna be like if you do that in Kenya. Of course, we're gonna support where we can. Thank he's you. been doing that lately. Wow, like he's nice, so into nice, that. Like nice, uh, nice, nice, he, he's nice, been nice. talking about it. So I feel nice, like we nice, could, yeah, nice, that could literally nice. work out. We help. Uh, we help for. We we are help to be raised. Like sorry, we help other people. We are sorry. People help us for us to, to help, help other others. people. I think and that's what I wanted stingy. to say when I was eating my tongue. <laughs> I know. And, and, and if you're stingy with the little you have, you're not gonna go you, far. You get you're me? Just, yeah, awesome. Give you us never lack. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> that's true. All right. And apart from like, because you look fabulous, because Thank you you. not only do music, you also are you are a designer. Clothing line, yeah. You have, have a clothing, clothing line. line. Yeah, so tell closet. us about that and how you've been finding balance between hmm. that and music. That's like a side hustle for me mm -hmm. because you know you just have to keep do keep you just have to do whatever you have to do. Mm -hmm. So uh, and apart from that, probably if I wasn't doing music, I would have been an, uh, a proper design. proper a fashion designer. Yeah. You know because I love fashion. So what I do is like for me for me music is like ninety percent of music, ten percent of the clothing line. Right. So but I have people handling it. So I just give them idea of what I want them to create for me, then they create it and that's it. Oh, nice. Thank you. Must be nice, right? Hey, it's true. like, oh, so I was thinking we do this and there's someone who's taking notes and then they bring it and it's done. No. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's not, it's not done. <laughs> you help way. out a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I help right? out a little like bit. Like the sketches. Yeah, the sketches. Like yeah. yeah, but it's not th a thing that I I put my whole energy on because my music is my number one. Your music is your my number, number one. one. Yeah, we get mm -hmm. that. All right, so you had your first EP not so long ago. That was that was in twenty nineteen. That was twenty nineteen. Yeah. Grateful. Grateful. Yes. Yeah. So tell us about that. The album. Grateful was a, 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 a it was a state that I was at that particular time, you know, coming back to music, trying to do thing, uh, the thing I love doing, and you know, because at a point when I took a break, it was it wasn't easy then. So I just, you know, while returning back, it's like, oh, I'm doing this now. Oh God, I'm grateful. That was the, it's, I think it's a five track EP. Yeah. I talked about grateful. I talked about girls are brave, girls are tired. Mm -hmm. Then uh, love is sweet for the love of birds. Yeah. Then uh, <laughs> an African woman. Mm -hmm. That's the domestic uh, voice of a woman, voice of an African. You know, I was just trying to still lend my voice to, to the women, to, mm -hmm. you know. Right. Yeah. And that was amazing. How did it perform? The it, it was, it, for me, it was a kickoff. You know, it was a kickoff to, to the to, to reintroduce. The, do you understand what I'm the, saying? To the industry. Yes, yes. All right. So, um, what do you think? Like taking time off, that means you're working on yourself and everything. I so wasn't. What, what have you learned while you're away? What are you currently working on? That because now you have another EP. Another EP. Of yeah. course. Mm -hmm. So that means you must have done something right. So you feel like the break was necessary. It was. It mm -hmm. was because I then I back then when I finished uh, Project Fame. I didn't know a whole lot about music, like in the business aspect of it. Yeah. I just wanted to do music. I just wanted to, you know, to sing. sing. Yeah, yeah. Well, as I'm singing, I have to make money. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> yeah. So that was it. So I, I it was a, it was a time for me to just, you know, learn and lean back and just understand myself the better. Right. Yeah. And now you have Gaza. Yeah, Gaza. Gaza is the latest <laughs> one. All right. Gaza, yeah. And you actually go by Gaza. Gaza AKA. That's my name. That's yeah. like Lisa George, AKA Gaza. Yeah. Gaza is my personality. Okay. I have like two personalities. I have oh, so Lisa that's your alter ego. Alter, thank you. Oh, that's your my alter ego. Gaza is the alter ego. You so you vibe with Vibes Cartel or yeah. how did that come about? <laughs> okay, that's what I'm saying. I, I think I said something like that. I said I was saying that my mom, when I was young, quite yeah. young, my mom listens to a whole lot of um, Jamaican music. Island music. Um, but, by, but when I did Grateful, when I came back then, mm. I just wanted to give especially where I'm from, Nigeria, to give that oh, Afro beat, Afro sound kind of. I wanted to just please people, displeasing myself. Yeah. But in, with, with the long run, or rather, after the grateful, I just, ha I just figured a way to balance it up, mm -hmm. being me and still giving people what they like. Right. So that's the Gaza thing. Okay, yeah. so now we have a whole EP, yeah. seven Called, tracks. No, 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 seven, five. Five tracks Sorry, as four. well. Four track, uh -huh. five. Grateful is five. Okay. Gaza EP is four. 
Oh. Yeah, four. Nice. So um, uh, tell us about the album. Like That is your latest yeah. project. Yep. So yes, tell yes, us about yes, it. Yes. What inspired it? Okay. And who have you worked with on okay. the album? Before the Gaza EP, I worked with Skibi. I don't know if you know Skibi. I've seen that. that yeah. Is Fiba he's, he's big. Yeah. He's, he's like really big. How do you even uh, get, get an attention of someone like that? I know him, he's my friend. <laughs> oh, we were in the studio, yeah, we were yeah. in the studio together. It was like, I, I started doing the chorus of that song. He mm. was like, wow, Lisa, I think I like what you're doing here. Let me voice on it. Let me, he's my G, he's my oh, nigga. Nice. So that was how Fibadijo came to be. I know. Then it was after Fibadijo, I now dropped the Gaza EP, right. which is the fourth track mm -hmm. that contains Weekend, Call Upon Me, My Type, and Carry Me. Yeah. So in that Gaza EP, I was just trying to express my inner me. Everything that I said there was 100% unfiltered. Me, yeah. I didn't filter anything. So I you wrote it yourself. I wrote yes. it my. I wrote it myself. Yeah. But as I'm trying to also give them the Gaza because I'm introducing Gaza. People don't know me as Gaza. They know me as Lisa George. So I was trying to introduce Gaza. Mm -hmm. I said, okay, let me let me find a way to balance it because not everybody that actually list here is a patois. Mm -hmm. So there's a one track there that has the Lisa George. Apart from Gaza, yeah. Remember, I said I have two, two yes. outer, uh, two yes, personality. Yes, yes, yes. So, so there's Lisa, there's Lisa, Lisa George, and there's Gaza. Gaza now. Thank you. The so three, Gaza is the is the call the, upon me weekend. Yeah. My mm. type is Gaza. Yeah. But carry me is that Lisa, is Lisa. George, the calm, mm -hmm. sweet girl, the sexy girl. <laughs> but Gaza is a, you know. <laughs> Lisa, you get, you get the vibe Gaza now. goes hard. Gaza goes we hard. Love Thank Gaza. you. Gaza I goes hard. Uh, everybody, a lot of people love girl. Gaza more. <laughs> I'm all about Gaza. And for people who don't know, we're going to have a taste of that. You're going to be performing for no Irish problem. Minute. But no I think my favorite out of the EP is Call Upon Me. Call Upon Me. Yeah. And the video is it's almost, out. It's, it's out on YouTube yeah. and it's out everywhere. It's out. You can it's, go check it you out. You have more than half a million views yes, in just yes, one month. Yes, how, yes, do you, yes. do, how do you do that? I think people, people just struggle. like, I think people just like the vibe they're connecting <laughs> with it. Like, I don't know. I don't know. It's magic. I don't it's know. Magic. It's a magic. It's magic, but we love it. And you're going to be performing for us in a no minute. Problem. But before you do that, uh, your socials, uh, social, social media. media. Okay. Yeah. On my Instagram at I am Lisa George. And she's All very together. Fine. She's very fine. On Twitter at <laughs> I am Lisa George. Mm -hmm. Then on TikTok, Lisa George Niger. Okay. Period. Lisa George, Niger. Niger. But I love Nigerians, how you guys are proud of your country. Like, Niger. And every, <laughs> everybody has to mention that. Like, you're you know, so there's, proud there's of There's that power of Nigeria, Niger. That spirit of Nigeria. We, ca curious. we carry it everywhere. We can't hold it back. For, we can't hold it back. My friend Any from, Nigeria would know, would relate. My friend from Nigeria. Well, there's one thing I like about you guys' yeah. country. The way you guys embra embrace your, your language. Yeah, with Swahili. So he I said, so he I think I told him today. I said, the way you guys, the Swahili. 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 Have you learned any? Uh, there's something in touch. Kalim, Karibu. Karibu. Karibu is to say. Karibu. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome, yeah. yeah Karibu. 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 <laughs> There's another, there's another thing, there's another thing they're supposed to teach you. It's new. Okay. Yeah, we've, we've, we've not learned it yet. Lumbuktu. 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 Lumbuktu
How far? All right. So let's say in Wagwan. Wagwan, thank you. Ah. Wagwan, thank Wagwan, you, brother. You, All right, now, so let's wind up. Uh, where can people find your music? For those guys who want to stream your music okay. or just maybe go on YouTube and check okay, it out. Okay, you can check my music in Mudundo. Mm -hmm. Yes. You can check it on Audio Mark, Apple Music, iTunes. Then you can check it on my blog, on my, when you follow me on Instagram, just check my bio, click on my bio, and it will take you straight to my YouTube. Please make sure you subscribe. Oh. Like, comment. Of course. Mm -hmm. I'm sure they're going to do that. All right, so you're going to perform for us okay. now for the first time on Bounce Nation. Okay. Lisa, uh, Lisa George. Lisa or is it George. Gaza? Gaza. Gaza. Call so me, Gaza is going to perform Call Upon Me for the first time right here on Bounce Nation. Right. Let's go.